Hello everyone around the world. Welcome back to my channel. I don't know about House of Lovers Ministry. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so so that you'll be notified of my new videos. Guys, I would like to remind you all to read your Bible every day and apply His words every day because Jesus Christ is coming very, very soon. Get excited for that event, especially if you are a genuine believer or follower of of Jesus Christ he definitely gonna take you and I in heaven before he will pour the great wrath of God on this earth so <clears throat> those people who will be left behind will experience the great wrath of God in seven years so if you don't want to believe me read your Bible especially in the book of Revelation that's pretty intense and God is not scaring us he cares and love us to get to to help us all to get ready for that event but before he will come there are gonna be a great great tribulations so guys I really want to encourage you all to read your Bible because Jesus Christ is coming very soon, not only to take all his followers in heaven, but to for the judgment day. So he is requiring all of us to stand at the front of him to give an account of our lives here on earth. So this is only a friendly reminder, but if you don't want to read your Bible, you don't have to. But without Jesus Christ, you will go to hell. Not purgatory, but in hell. And then I have God's words here, guys, that I have been trying to work on. So, I have a lot of them that I've been posting only on my Facebook page. That is www.facebook.com slash And also, I have, a lot, I have not lots, but I have two books yet. I have already two books that I have published on Amazon. So the first edition, warning to this video, first edition has already reached other than 300,000 people around the world. And the second edition that I published, it's warning to this video, second edition. It is um, the, the 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 Amazon is not allowed to market my book because last um, my previous one, they marketed it because I had I enrolled it in. Um, you know, uh, book marketing. Although that I enrolled, they are supposed to, you know, uh, do the the right thing. But anyway, guys, I'm not gonna go that far. So the the second edition, guys, is way better than first edition. And you find out that if you wanna know, in this channel, you just browse this channel. You'll be able to find out about that difference of my first edition and second edition. And then um, you'll find out. A lot of them too. Them the like the the, the book comments, um, and about my two books only on my author's page. It is www.amazon.com slash author slash adrenal leverance. And I've been working for the third book. I have a lot of books to write, guys. But anyway, guys, so much for that because I'm heading to work very very soon here. Um, <clears throat> so I have a good God's word. That the Holy Spirit spoke to me. So this is uh, God's word letter A. <laughs> the Holy Spirit spoke to me last June 5th, 2021. So that was three years ago, guys. All right, the title of this message, guys, is Be Yourself. All right, Be Yourself. The word says, be yourself that doesn't mean that we will do whatever we like for ourselves even if it's against the will of god in the book of genesis chapter 1 verse 27 in kgv or new king james version it says so god created man in his own image in the image of god he created him male and female he created them God has a purpose why he created man and woman. One of them is one of them is for procreation. Man and man again man and man 
cannot procreate. Cannot procreate a new life. Nor woman and woman. God wants us to play the role of what he created us to be. If you are male, then be a male. Again, if you are male, then be a male. If you're a woman, then be a woman. He also wants us to use the talents and gifts that he gave us for his glory and for his kingdom. He created us to love, worship, and serve him. There are lots of verses that will teach us how to take care of ourselves. God knows our limitations. Like if we keep drinking alcohol every day, we already, we already know that too much alcohol in our body can cause liver cancer. And definitely, and definitely will mess up our brain, right? And definitely will mess up our brain. He wants us to take care of ourselves. In 1 Corinthians chapter 6, verse 19, in KGV or New King James Version, it says, Or do you not know that your body is the temple of the Holy Spirit who is in you, whom you have from God, and you are not your own? Our body is the dwelling place of the Holy Spirit. Since it's his dwelling place, he expects us to take care of of our body and live a holy life in the book of first peter chapter 1 verse 16 in kjv or new king james version it says because it is written be holy for i am holy let us not twist the saying be yourself be we don't need to copy others but be ourselves. I am adrenal. I stay adrenal. I can't be Maya. Nor Maya cannot be me. You can't be me and I can't be you. This is on ad lib, guys. But follow what the Bible say. For who you are in Christ. You if you are born again, if you are a believer of Jesus Christ, you are accepting Jesus Christ as your Lord, your God, and your Savior. If you're a man, you are the Son of the Living God. You are. You are an adopted child of the Living God, of the Living God through Jesus. If you're a woman, you are a daughter of the Living God. You are a daughter of a living God. So guys, follow this Bible for who you are in Christ. Now lots, there are more than 300 promises that Jesus talk about you here. This is a love letter from the Lord. But you need to open it. When you open it, you'll know his deep love in you his eternal love for you and i so that's the word guys if you have never received jesus christ as your lord you get in your savior today not tomorrow but today is the day of your salvation don't wait tomorrow because tomorrow is no guarantee for you you may get a day today or tomorrow with heart attack or anything without jesus christ you will go to hell not purgatory but in hell that's what the bible say here all you have to do is to repent Invite Jesus Christ as your Lord, you get, and your Savior, and then promise Him to follow Him for the rest of your life. You can pray your own simple prayer. You can pray along with a simple prayer. Here you go. Lord Jesus Christ, please forgive me for all my sins. Please come into my heart and into my life and be my Lord, my God, and my Savior. From now on, Jesus, I will follow you for the rest of my life. Amen. So if you pray the simple prayer according to the Bible, your name is written in the book of life, but 
if you're still rejecting Jesus Christ as your Lord, your God, and your Savior, according to the Bible, in the book of Revelation, chapter 20, verse 15, it says, If anyone's name was not found written in the book of life, was casted in the lake of fire. So guys, take this as a warning and invitation. You have a blessed day. Bye-bye.